Do you feel left out in the cold when it comes to making money online? Well, that's because you don't have a lead magnet. What's a lead magnet, you might ask? Well, it's that fancy thing the gurus use to build huge mailing lists and make lots of money. But there's two problems here. First of all, it's not really cold. I'm in Florida and it rains when it's hot. Second of all, this is not a lead magnet. It's just for effect. It's an old piece of barbecue. Let's go ahead and hop inside and talk about how you can create lead magnets that will make you money on demand starting right now. Hey guys, it's Marcus here and welcome inside the backyard office. It's dark, it's late, but we're going to make this video anyway because you need to learn all about lead magnets, how to make them, how to get the most profit, how to build your mailing list, and everything like that. And if you like learning this kind of stuff and you want to join us live on our live trainings and check out my new videos and everything, make sure you subscribe to the channel right now by clicking the subscribe button, then click the bell notification icon so you get all my latest releases and you're notified when we go live. But for right now, after you do that, make sure you subscribe, right? After you do that, we're going to go ahead and dive right in and talk about lead magnets. What is a lead magnet? Well, a lead magnet is something that you can offer to your visitors in exchange for some information of theirs. Maybe their contact info, name and email, sometimes maybe name, email, and phone or address or something like that. But it's something that gives you info about your customers so that you can write to them, you can follow up with them, and make money and give them cool stuff, right? That's what it's all about is giving cool stuff and you can see an example of this over at my site affiliate marketing dude.com where we tell you to go there and we say put your name and email so that you can get our free affiliate marketing toolbar now after you get that toolbar we also send you emails and webinars and cool videos and stuff like that so everyone's happy and it works really well and you're able to convert your visitors into sales and into subscribers which is good right that makes you more money so here let's go ahead and dive right in first of all you have your people these are the people who are going to come to your site or the people that are now on your site. Now, when you look at these people, it's important to know what they want and why they're there. The question you have to ask is, why are these people on my website in the first place? Where did they come from? Did they come from a free Google listing on Google SEO? And if so, what did they click, right? They might have clicked a link that said, uh, get a free affiliate marketing toolbar. Or they might have clicked something that said, you know, um, guy makes money feeding walruses or something like that, if that's the case. But the fact of the matter is, is you need to know why they're there. So we're going to use the example here of a banner ad that I run. Okay. I run this banner ad. I spend about three to $4,000 a month running these types of banner ads, uh, sometimes more, sometimes less, depends on the inventory. So I have these banner ads. Now we're going to look at this because this is a simple way to break it down. Okay. So I look at the people and I say, okay, if I run a banner ad on a site, who are the people looking at the site? Well, in this case, the people looking at the site are interested in affiliate marketing. Okay, so these are my people. They're here. They came from this banner. Okay, so I know about them. Now, same thing if you're using Google AdWords, then it would be your ad, right? Your ad would say, um, you know, how to lose 10 pounds in a week or whatever. They come to your site, you know, because they clicked it, they want to lose 10 pounds in a week. Very simple. Okay, this is how we build uh, our marketing audience, this is how we build our lead magnet to really fit what they want, okay? So first of all, they come into my site and they say, okay, simple three-page affiliate blog, profits $287 daily, and it only took 45 minutes to build, right? It builds their curiosity. They're like, wow, I want to see that site. I want to watch that video. So those are my people, right? They want to watch this video. That's why they're here, okay? So now what I have to do is I have to say, well, what can I give them? Okay, well, I could give them access to the video. That, that would be kind of cool, right? I can give them a PDF report. Okay, give them a good PDF report. Um, I can give them a Excel spreadsheet if I'm in a market like mortgages or budgets or something like that. I could give them uh, access to several videos. I can give them a list. I can give them a download. I can give them a toolbar, which is actually really easy to make. I can give them a software product or a trial. I can give them all kinds of things. Okay, The things that we give them are our lead magnets. So what we want to do is we want to say, what is something that, that we can give away that they're really going to like and get results from? Okay, One of the big keys to building a lead magnet is that you build in some kind of results, right? So if I say I'm in the weight loss market and I say, you know, have, has every other diet failed you? Well, get this PDF and it's really going to help you. Okay. And in, in that PDF, I give them something really simple. I say, here's what I want you to do. 
I don't want you to change anything. I just want you to eat an apple every day, right? They're going to go through in the next three days. They'll be like, wow, I was able to eat that apple every day. That's really cool. I like that. I got results. Or for example, if I'm in the market where I'm teaching people how to set up blogs, I would go through and say, hey, here's a really easy way to set up a blog. Okay. And now they go do it, right? This is a marketing technique I learned from Frank Kern, where he said you do results in advance, right? You give them some kind of results in advance. And they used it in the dating market where they said, well, hey, look, you know, if someone's looking to date and they're afraid and they don't know how to approach a girl or a guy, tell them something simple. Give them a simple pickup line, give them a simple word to say, whatever, right? And they go test it out and they come back and they're like, hey, that Marcus guy's really swell. That lead magnet told me something. I went and did it and it worked. So therefore I want more. Okay, so it's very important you do that. A lot of people get this wrong and they give crappy PDFs or rehashed garbage or something not really usable for the people. Okay, if I'm in the market, I want to give them something good, something that almost hurts, something that I'm like, maybe I should charge for this, right? That's why we give such good stuff away because I know that it creates trust and I know it makes people buy things down the line and they anticipate emails because they're like, wow, I'm going to get cool stuff. Okay, so our lead magnet, again, needs to be based on why the visitor's there. Take a look at your ads, take a look at your search engine rankings if you're doing that, if you're bringing them from YouTube videos, what video did they come from and what did you promise, right? Like at the end of this video, I could say go over to affiliatemarketingdude.com to get your free toolbar. Boom, you're going to go there and if the site doesn't say free toolbar within like five seconds, you're going to be like, I'm out. I don't want to check this out because Marcus said it's going to be there. Okay, so your customers are going to be the same way. Your visitors are going to be the same way. All right, so we take our visitors, okay, and those visitors come from our banner ad or advertisement or our search engine ranking. Okay, now we know something about them because they clicked. Okay, it's like getting people to raise their hand. It's like, okay, they clicked, they checked it out. Yay, wonderful. Now what we need to do is we need to take them Okay, and they are going to be on our lead getting page. Okay, now our lead getting page is going to look something like this. Okay, this is our lead getting page. All right, very, very simple. Now on our lead getting page, I could actually bring up an example. Let me see if I can do this for you. On our lead getting page, it could be like affiliatemarketingdude.com, right? I have this video here. You go there. It's like, hey, here's the free toolbar. Okay, that's how it works. Same thing, no matter what market you're in, this will work. Very simple, very direct. Here's the video telling you what you're going to get. Here's the boxes over here saying here's where to get them. Okay, very cool. All right, so now what we have to do is we have them on our page, and we're like, okay, check this out. Now, you can have a video or you can have an image. Sometimes if I'm giving away a PDF, I'll actually put an image of the PDF there, okay? Or if I have a video, I would actually go through and let's see, put a video there, okay? So I'd be like, hey, check this out. Here's the video, okay? Above the video, I would have some kind of headline. Let's see if we can get a headline here. Our headline would be, um, get my free weight loss calculator plus PDF on how to lose weight, okay? I think we need to stretch it out here. And again, this isn't going to be perfect because we're just kind of matching this out here. Get the free weight loss calculator and PDF guide to losing weight, okay? Very cool. Now, we would do that, and then, of course, we would have over here on the side, we would have our name and email boxes, Okay, so we'd have it right here. And I, I usually like to put some arrows or something pointing at this so that it kind of stands out more. Okay, and then we're going to go through right like this. Okay, we'll have some extra arrows and stuff like that. All right, and then we have like name, and then we have email. And then boom, we'll have like a submit button here that says, you know, get my stuff or whatever, right? You would have like get toolbar, download videos, get access, uh, whatever it is that fits what you are trying to convey here. Okay, now again, remember, your giveaway or your lead magnet needs to be based on what the market wants. You need to really look into their pain points. Like, what do they want? Like, I know the dieting market, they're people that have tried lots of things and they've failed and they haven't gotten results and they're kind of jaded and they're tired of stuff. 
I know the money making market, right? They're they're the t- same way. They've tried a bunch of things. They haven't worked. They're kind of jaded, and they're like, "What next? What's going to work?" Okay, so we want to give them simple, sim- something simple that they can do really fast. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to give them a PDF or a uh, guide or something like that, or even a video guide uh, that shows them something. Okay, so really cool. We'll get a image for our giveaway. Where's our giveaway image here? Uh, let's see. Oh, well, we'll just take them to another page. There we go. Okay. And the page here is our thank you page. Okay. On the thank you page, this is where you give your stuff away. Okay. So you're going to give your stuff away. And again, you know, you want to make it something that, that is really, really beneficial, something that works for them, uh, something that's going to help them. Okay. Now, what I usually do is I create my lead magnet to get them some kind of little result, some kind of taste, some kind of um, example, something that says, hey, look, this is going to work. I'm going to give you good stuff. Now, if you're in the recipe market, you could do the same kind of thing. It's like, hey, check it out. Um, I know you've been trying to make this kind of chicken cacciatore, and we're going to show you how to make it the best way. Try it out. And when your family loves it, come back and check out my other stuff, and I'll send you other recipes. Right? What this is going to do is it's going to put in your, your visitor's mind, hey, you know what? That guy's pretty cool. He gave me a recipe. It worked. My family liked it. And now I'm back for more. Okay, so really cool. You want to really, really give goodwill. You want to provide a sense of community and goodwill, and you want them to anticipate what you're going to do next. Now, another tip for your giveaway is that you need to subtly embed in your lead magnet stuff that's going to get them to buy. Okay, really cool. Now, what I can do is I can do this with affiliate stuff. So in the example of how to make a blog, I could probably give them get them into like web hosting or something, um, and then I can also get them into maybe a course on how to set up blogs for weight loss. I can get them to come back to my blog because the goal is to get them to come back. Right, the whole idea of a mailing list, the whole idea of a lead magnet, is to get people to come back to your stuff. That's why it has to be of the utmost value based on why they're there in the first place, based on what they want. And you can even ask them what they want. You can learn about them. You can build perfect lead magnets. You can have 20 different lead magnets and test them out, and then maybe take those and put them in a course or something and sell it and make lots of money or put them in a blog post and make lots of off of that as well. But your lead magnet really needs to uh, connect with the marketplace and really give them something uh, that's going to give them value right up front, whether it's like an aha moment, whether it's an understanding, whether it's something simple like, hey, you know what, here's how to build a birdhouse or whatever. Here's how to take care of your puppy. Here's how to get your puppy to stop biting, right? If I was able to get a book, because my puppy right now like bites everything and she's a maniac. And um, if I had a book that was like, hey, you know what, here's how to stop your puppy from biting. And he's like, hey, check this out. And I went and did it and my puppy stopped biting. I would go back to that guy and check out what he had, whether it was like an affiliate for pet insurance, whether it's a course on how to train your dog, whether it's a, a dog fence, whatever, right? I, I would use that because that guy gave me some kind of result. That guy gave me something that's going to work. So you want to get away from the branded PLR BS that everyone else does, right? You can use that. That's fine. But don't use it as your best foot forward because your lead magnet is your best foot forward, right? And what I do is on my toolbar that I give away, we like pack it with stuff, right? So right here, I'm like, boom, you give it away. Boom, there they are. We actually have like 5,000 people every month using this toolbar. There should be more. I haven't really promoted it as much as I should. But we have like 5,000 people. And what happens is they click this stuff. So every month they're like, boom, check this out. Boom, check that out. Hey, go here. Hey, go here. Go do this, right? And they're checking this stuff out and they're watching the videos and they're doing the stuff. And this thing makes me money because it builds trust. And they're like, check this out. This works, right? And we give them really small stuff like the seven day blog profits course, right? That goes through. It shows you how to build a blog and set it up in seven days in a really, really easy way, right? So it gives you some kind of result. So what I want you to do is I want you to create a lead magnet based on what your market wants, why they're there in the first place, okay? Look at the keyword, look at the banner, look at however they're getting to you. Build a lead magnet that really, really helps them, whether it's a PDF, audio recording, link to a podcast, a video, whether it's a Excel spreadsheet for people, whether it's a toolbar, whether it's a little piece of software, whatever it is, it could even be a list of things, whatever it is, help them out, get them on your list, and then pump them some other really good stuff in their email and show them that you really care, which hopefully about your market you do 
kind of care about them, right? Because you want to help them and get them a good result. So that's kind of the idea. Now, last tip I'll give you is to brand whatever it is with your info, okay? Because if you do a PDF, it's going to get passed around, it'll get saved, and people aren't going to remember you, all right? So you don't want to put like just affiliate links in your PDF. Make sure they're links back to your site, affiliatemarketingdude.com slash this, affiliatedude.com slash that, whatever, right? So make them your own links. Video, same th thing. Make it your own links on a domain that you own. Uh, if it's an Excel spreadsheet, right? Up in the corner, put uh, courtesy of whatever your domain is or, hey, get more spreadsheets at whatever it is. If you're giving away a free theme for WordPress users, get more themes at, right? Put it on the bottom. Like with our themes, um, one of the themes that I give away, we actually have on the bottom of it. Let me see if I can find it. Uh, let's see. Affiliate dude dot affiliate affiliate dude.com I can't spell today affiliate dude.com right on this one I actually created this theme for uh, social media so people go and they get their Instagram and we give the free theme away so they can make this cool thing and on the bottom I have custom theme by social uh, profit tools boom there it is a link to my site on everyone who uses it now I got all these things pointing at me and boom we get a bunch of traffic off it so make your lead magnets point back to you that's the goal get it to point back to you get people to like you get people to know you get people to trust you so that they're anticipating your next email so that you can subtly in a cool way that helps them sell stuff that benefits them and get paid. So that's the name of the game. I hope you enjoyed this little video on how to create a lead magnet, how to set it up, how to structure it, what it's going to look like. And of course, on your thank you page, that's where you put it. Hope you enjoyed it. Check out affiliatedude.com. Check out that toolbar. You can see how to do that. And um, you can use the toolbar to make money as well. So thanks again. Subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.